What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Mila B, and welcome back to another video. So this is a skincare routine video. I am going to do a product review on, y'all know, my favorite brand, Freeman Beauty. This right here is the French Pink Clay Peel-Off Mask. It's for pore cleansing. So I already read the directions. Basically, you're supposed to put it on a dry face, let it sit for about 10 to 15 minutes until it gets hard, peel it off, and then you're good to go. It is supposed to detoxify your pore for a fresh glowing complexion. And I have a day here, not cute. I got, my skin's just been breaking out, it's becoming uneven again. And that's just not the move and that's just not how we roll. So without further ado, let's get into it. I am about to open it. I got a pouch, so I get three to four uses out of it. It smells good. Let's try it out. I wouldn't have pegged the texture for it to be this way, but I guess since it is a peel off mask, I would, I would don't know why I didn't assume that this would be the texture. This is definitely the texture of any other type of peel off mask. So I've let the mask sit. You can see around my mouth it's peeling up. The reason this is happening is because I ate and my mouth was doing a lot of moving, so it got loose. So I am just gonna try and peel it all off. If you've seen any of my other videos, then you know one peel mask are my favorite, and the ones that don't hurt are the bomb.com. And this one is doing pretty good. It is actually doing pretty good. No complaints right now. No complaints at all. My cheeks are a little, I don't think my cheeks are all the way dry. Yeah, that cheek isn't all the way dry. So it appears that my cheeks aren't fully dry, which I kind of knew because I did put it on thicker in my cheeks. I always do that for some reason. So what I'm going to do is get my towel and I have some hot, a bowl of, hot, of water in front of me. And we're gonna scrub it off. So far I like this mask, I like the color of it. My face does feel a bit softer. And the smell wasn't too strong, it was very tolerable. I think if I did a thinner layer on my cheeks, it, it would have came off in one big peel. But this isn't bad. This is not bad at all. Overall, I really do enjoy that mask. It didn't hurt when I peeled it off. The color was a really cute pink color. The smell wasn't that strong. It did kind of remind me of a sea salt ocean type scent to it, but I enjoyed that mask. Next time I'm gonna put a thinner layer on my cheeks, but my pores, they feel so, so, so good. I'm gonna follow up with my moisturizing spray and then do my makeup. So you guys are ready to do, like, share, comment, do not forget to subscribe, and I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye y'all.